Hey guys, what is up? Um, welcome back to my channel right here. I'm with my mom. She's heading to the gym. I am not. <laughs> uh, but I want to go ahead and give you guys a room tour because we are in a five star hotel right now. This is the most expensive. Whoa, hello, lighting. Can we go up there? Can we please? Yes. yes. No, 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 no. We're going to do it now. Okay, we're going to go up because um, it says. Um, so we're going to go back up. <laughs> We're gonna go all the way. We're already in the lobby. We're gonna go all the way up to the terrace. Whoa! Oh gosh, guys! Holy cow! Whoa! How cool is this? I just realized that I didn't really give you any uh, real explanation of what we are doing. So basically, today I am at a five-star hotel. We only have two five-star hotels in my city. This is the most expensive hotel in all of Pittsburgh. So this is where we're at, and we're just kind of going to be hanging out, chilling out out here. Um, I'm here with my mom for Mother's Day. And if you're curious, yes, I paid for the hotel. Um, it was not her. Um, but no, it's um, we're just basically going to be hanging out, chilling, trying to see if it's worth the hype you know of the price and if it's worth the rating and I don't know it's just gonna be a really chill video so if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to go ahead and hit the subscribe button right here right now we are on the terrace this is pretty cool we're all the way up um, on the 10th floor I think that's what it said it was here is beautiful Pittsburgh <laughs> mom can you see anything out the, over there yeah. really I wonder if I can this is not going to be a thing whoa kind of is no, it's not. So we're gonna go walk you guys down to, oh, there's even like restrooms here. Stairs. This is so cool. Let's take the stairs. I am not taking the stairs down 10 floors. Everyone is on like 10 floors. So there's restrooms up here, and then there must be rooms up here too. I feel like we got gypped. Someone just opened up a door. Let's just get back on. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. We can't figure this out. Um, let's go to lobby. There's supposed to be a fitness lounge or a fitness center, and we can't find it. It's like an entire floor, supposedly. It said it's half. Take elevator one. Down. Down. We're gonna try it. While we wait for the elevator, I do want to go ahead and show you guys around the lobby. Like this place is so cool. Okay, we're gonna, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, there we go, there we go. Okay, cracker. Now, finally. Yeah, there we go. It only took us 20 minutes. It's supposed to be like a whole floor? This is a 24 hour fitness. Ooh. Whoa. Mom, this is actually really cool. Hey, hi guys, what is up? This is um our little tour of this hotel. I feel like I don't belong here. Awesome. I know, isn't this cool? Oh gosh, you can tell that like, we're not used to staying in five star hotels. <laughs> we, um, I'm usually good with a good, um, what would it be, like a Hampton? A Hampton Inn? <laughs> oh, Comfort Inn. Sorry. Okay, we are going to continue on with our tour. Mom, there's even towels over here and mats and a water fountain. Do you want me to get you a water? Sounds good. It'll be a couple hours. Okay. Love you. So now we, I don't think there's anything else on this floor. There's not. Just restrooms. There's stairs. What do these stairs lead to? Oh, a locked door. Walking back downstairs. <laughs> My mom said the room is three. 703? 703. Where is it at? No, over here. Okay, one, two, perfect. 703 is our room. Oh, this place is so cute. Not gonna lie, I kind of thought it would be a little bit bigger, especially for how much we paid for this room, but it's still really nice. Okay, let me give you the little tour even though my mom's already kind of started to unpack. So this is our beautiful bathroom. I feel like I'm not going to be able to do this bathroom justice. How freaking cute is this? And then you walk over here. Like I said, I just don't feel like I'm gonna be able to do this room justice. Here, we already started to unpack. 
And then a nice full length mirror. Oh, you can't even see me because of the window. Here we go. Oh, these are, so this is the race that we're doing tomorrow. This is the Susan G. Komen race for the cure. We got a nice little closet over here. Oh. What is something that I never really understood? Like, do you guys unpack your clothes whenever you go to a hotel? Because I actually know people who do. They like, they whenever they get to the hotel, they like hang up all their clothes. I don't know. I've never been that kind of person. Like over here is just, my stuff is going to sit here. Literally until tomorrow. It's not going to move at all. I guess I just never really understood like why would you unpack your stuff if you're only going to be there for like 24 hours because that's like going to a hotel unpacking your clothes hanging them all up right and then you're going to wear them put them back in your suitcase go home and then have to hang them up again I don't know if I'm making any sense but I've just never hung up my clothes comment down below do you guys hang up your clothes when you go to a, like a hotel also the other thing that I've always been curious about and I might just you know be stupid I don't know but have any of you ever ironed your clothes when you go to a hotel like every single hotel I've ever been to always has a iron and an ironing board but who goes to a hotel and is like you know what I think I want to iron my clothes today I don't know I guess I just don't understand it maybe if I was going for a business trip and I had like if I was a guy and I had a suit or something but I went on business trips and still never ironed my clothes and then we have the beautiful view of Pittsburgh out here Sometimes I feel like I'm a fake Pittsburgh <laughs> uh, resident because I live outside of Pittsburgh, probably about an hour outside of the city, and I don't know anything about Pittsburgh. Like, if you guys are from Pittsburgh, comment down below, but like, I couldn't tell you where Southside is, I couldn't tell you where Shadyside is, Squirrel Hill, um, downtown, like, I don't know where they are in comparison to each other. Also, I was thinking about this, and I don't know if I'm going to do it, but I was definitely thinking of doing maybe, maybe a meet and greet in Pittsburgh. We'll see, I would need to actually organize it and maybe like figure out like, where we could go even if it's just 15 people get a room somewhere uh, maybe at a restaurant or something and we can all go maybe Starbucks I don't know does Starbucks have like extra rooms in the back or something maybe we can find a fancy Starbucks um, but that would be really cool so comment down below if that's something you would maybe be interested in now that the announcements are out of the way um let me back away and show you guys actually how big this room is it's like so here's the door and you just walk in and like, this is it. I got my room key, so I'm gonna take you guys down. Um, oh, no, 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 there we go. Sorry, the elevator like shut on me. Okay, we are going down to restaurant and bar. This place is so cute. Here, look at this. The lounge here is so freaking cute. I actually, I have to film a Q&A later today. Um, and I literally should film it here, but I, the music, I would totally get copyrighted. So I'll probably just do that in the hotel room. Here, we're gonna walk downstairs and then we'll hop back in the elevator and head back up. Cause I think that's all there is, but look how pretty this is. Literally, if it wasn't for the copyrighted music right now, I would totally be filming my Q&A down here. Like, and then I think there's another restaurant here too. Oh, there is. Oh, this is so cool. Gosh. We are back in the room. I want to pull out, I had Starbucks earlier, so I'm gonna pull out my Starbucks. All right, so I am now in my hotel room. I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about, you know, the beginning of this video was all like crazy and weird and I was just walking around with my mom and kind of giving you guys a little bit of a tour. Do I think that it was worth it? No, <laughs> cause this hotel was like, I mean, it was in the 500s, like that's insane. And then we spent three, sorry, what am I saying? We spent like $36 on valet parking too, because there's no, I, at least I couldn't find any overnight parking garages in the area. So I felt like valet parking was like the only option for me. And a little bit of a backstory, like I am such a country gal. We grew up 
staying at like motel sevens and like comfort inns and like all of that i am not used to five star hotels i guess i would say not gonna lie i had a lot of anxiety about this video just because i knew i was wasting five hundred dollars on doing this video um do i think it was worth it no i think i would be just as happy in like a hampton if that makes sense and if i would have just paid like a hundred dollars I don't want to sound like I'm downgrading this hotel. Like this is really cool. The customer service that I've received today has been amazing. And I mean, like I said, I've never experienced valet parking before. So that was really cool. Everything's in a walking distance. So maybe you're paying for location. Um, the room is beautiful. Like this is gorgeous. This is the nicest hotel room I've ever been in. Um, it is small, but we definitely, we got a deluxe king and it's really small in here. Like, I guess I just like expected to like walk in and it was gonna be bigger. The restaurant's amazing. Um, the lounge area is super cool. But like I said, like I would be just as happy in a Hampton. You know what I mean? I don't know. Comment down below if you guys would feel the same way or do you like like the luxury of staying in five star hotels? I don't know. And maybe, you know, it's also, it's so clean too. Like I looked, I looked in the little cracks of the bathroom and everything like it is, it is clean. I mean, those are perks, but I don't know. I would just, I would be just as happy in a Hampton paying $120. Sometimes you can get Hamptons for even like $89. Um, but yeah. I don't know i would just be just as happy so um i don't know that was today's video but i hope that you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you made it all the way to the end and you did not hit the subscribe button what are you doing come on hit the subscribe button we just hit 50 000 subscribers that is crazy in my next video that um i'm going to post um i'm going to be doing a q a so i'm actually going to film that right after this video i'm going to be doing a giveaway which is really exciting so you guys should watch that next video i'm going to have it posted right here it's going to go out literally tomorrow if you're watching this the day that this came out so they're going to be back to back but yeah so i'm so excited thank you so much for 50,000 subscribers what is my life like i don't want to say it's like changed so much it hasn't changed I don't know. I'll talk about this in the next video. Um, but I just want you guys to know, like, I super appreciate you guys. I even hit 10,000 followers on Instagram. Like, what is my life right now? So you guys should definitely um, hit that subscribe button. Join the family if you're new. Uh, be sure to go ahead and give it a big thumbs up, you know, if you liked it. Um, and yeah, so this is today's video. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. I will see you tomorrow. Watch my video. Um, okay, <laughs> bye.